We are in match two. Yes, I'd like to play first. Uh, hmm. This game doesn't seem awful. It's not the best. If I wasn't on the play, I don't think I'd keep this. But I'm gonna keep it. Sometimes you can keep... Like, it's really normally not very good to keep non aether vile hands, but if you have a curve like this, it's not horrible. Except at this, yeah, and then I have some redundancy for the Thoughtseize, so I'm assuming he'll take my Master of the Pearl Trident here. Yeah. Well, Curse Catcher is not horrible. Would have been better last turn. I could have countered that Thought Seize. Straight up junk. Yeah, and this Goyf's not going to stay big very long. That is what he's playing as a Rep Decay on. I am a okay with that. Oh, that does kind of suck. Didn't think about that. If he attacks with his Goyf, I will not be blocking, as he can, with those two fetch lands, instantly make it bigger. I'm not interested in that. Another abrupt decay. Maybe two abrupt decays. Dismember. Well, I'm gonna counter that. lethal but okay all right so gonna bring in hibernation spell skite maybe not spell skite i think i have enough hate between tidebinder hibernation 
and Relic. So what's kind of bad? I guess Curse Catcher. No, he's playing Dismember. I think I actually do think Curse Catcher is among the weakest things here because like Spreading Seas is good. The Lords are all good. Tidebinder Mage is good. Dismember is good. Hibernation is good. Maybe I'll go have these on Dismember and Curse Catcher. Yeah, this looks good. Master of Waves is just such a... Maybe I'll go do one less Master. Alright, let's try this out. I'll see you... No, oh, wait. That's what I want. I think I want all the Dismembers. Alright, I'll see you guys in the next game.